energy depression is a bitch that won't stop texting me hi guys welcome back i am finally back after my children wanted to pass around a sinus infection a sinus infection that also caused conjunctivitis pink eye it was not fun it was the first time i've ever gotten it and i was like this is never happening to me again so i'm not wearing any false lashes if i look like a naked mole rat to you that is why <laughs> but we're here because i picked up some new things and you know loves that from that i wanted from shop miss a and some new things that i was pretty excited about sharing so we can try in a different video so if you want to see what they are and what i'm thinking then let's go ahead and get into it of course i had to grab some masks i already used one last night but I just grabbed some of the Kala ones because I find that I, I, I am liking them. The Kala Honey one is really good. The Kala Calming Tea Tree, needed right before, you know, Ant Flow. Um, the Hyaluronic Acid and Collagen, always great for us over 25ers. And then I wanted to try this because I haven't tried this one out before. It's the Skin Smoothie Avocado one. So we'll see. We'll see. I just like the experience most of all. As most of you know, it's my mommy time. They also did um, bring back the beauty topic under eye patches. So I grabbed four because I didn't have a lot of money. Otherwise, I would have grabbed the whole stock. I already used one. But these are my favorites out of any kind of under eye mask patch type of thing. And you can put something under it like a serum or something, a cream, and then stick these two. And then you can also do your eye makeup while wearing these and it'll catch it. There's so many other ways to use these. I just, I wish I had a thousand of these. They always sell out on, on almost at Amazon, but they almost, they always sell out on Shop Miss A. And that's why I'm like, ugh, restock quicker. I got um, an Isabella thick headband i really like these i also have one that is like this that's thick i wanted to show but this one's a little bit different and bigger i love these especially when i want my hair out of my face and i'm cleaning or something doing my skincare and i i just love those i like them a lot i'm glad that they finally came out with some kind of thicker type of headband i had to pick up more like i told you guys of my aoa invisible acne patches i cannot go without these they are lifesavers and the best i've tried and i've tried a ton even from mighty patch this was new so i had to pick it up this was a dollar 88 it is the aoa clear skin exfoliating face mitt I had I had to grab it. It just shows you like put your hand in it and you, you wash your face. It's a silicone, like a pink silicone. Um, it's easy, anti-aging, gentle, and anti-microbial. It says it has four skincare functions for pore cleansing, exfoliation, massage, and skeep and and skeep skeep skeep. <laughs> And skin depuffing. Oh my gosh. And of course it's washable. So I'm just having a grand old time. I also from that same line picked up two um, on accident of the AOA clear skin facial cleansing brushes. I'll put one into a giveaway because I accidentally probably pressed two. I like that it came with a cap on the brush head. And I'm excited to try it. These things are really easy when I want to... Um, wash my face in the shower versus the sink so and those look pretty good like they're gonna fit right in my caddy where I need them so I'll let you guys know how those are and as I said I picked up more of the bath salts I got the rose that I love but I picked up also the natural dead sea lavender I like the color I mean look how purple it's really nice I really like these so these are definitely something and I think the last one they have is cinnamon and I'm gonna get that one too like I'm I need to just go for broke on that site right now I really do mm, I'm trying to hold back I picked up the AOA and this is their shadow saver eye primer I wanted to try this it's been a hot minute since I have used eye primer and it's probably about time to start doing that because it really did help and then I did end up grabbing one of the Magical Girl lipsticks. And this, it, I didn't know that it came in packaging like this. I honestly thought it was an eyeshadow, like a, a roll-on eyeshadow at first. But it's just like the rest of their packaging. And you open up, this one is in Suki, I believe. But 
Oh, pretty. That's pretty. So I can't wait to try that out. Everything from this line has been amazing for me. So I'm pretty excited about it. And then I also just picked up the AOA Feather Ink Liner. I really wanted to try this. I saw this. I have never tried it. I don't know if any of you have. If you have, let me know. I love the packaging. It's so aesthetically cute. So I got that to try out. And then lastly, uh, these are what I'm excited about. The Because you guys know the everything, the flawless line, the primer, the concealer, you know, all of that is just, Really, I like it. So they came out with flawless pressed powders. So I got L2, which is a little yellow, and then I got L1, which seems perfect, and then I just got translucent, just in case, you know? And something tells me I'm going to absolutely love these, so I'm going to want them like that, summer, winter, and then whenever. You know what I mean? They're cheap enough. So I think they're like $1.88. I, I can't help but love it. So that is everything that I got from Shop Masse. Not a lot, but enough to have a little bit of fun because I still have a concealer and foundations. Now I have pressed powders and lipsticks and um, eye primers to try out in a get ready with me. So hopefully you guys will be seeing that soon. If you do want to see that, give this video a thumbs up. If you want to see more of these, of course, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe so you do not miss out. And I, of course, will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.